It's smoothie time! What's up everybody? Today we're gonna make an awesome strawberry watermelon coconut smoothie. Let's get started. So the first thing that I did was I went ahead and cut up pineapple, watermelon, strawberry, coconut, and banana. So I got all those ingredients together. Here's the list of them right here. I got all those together and I froze those fruits as well. I'm gonna put them into a cup. So this was before I froze them. I went ahead and I measured them just to make sure that they were proper, you know, proper amount inside a cup. So right there, there's your cup of frozen fruit. That's gonna be perfect amount for the blender, all right? So I took that cup of frozen fruit, I then put it into the baggie, and then I stuck that in the freezer for about 10 minutes, and it's perfect now, okay? So the first thing you wanna do is grab your cup of water. This cup of water, put that right into the blender. Boom, done, cool. Next, you're gonna take your plain Greek yogurt. This plain Greek yogurt is perfect. It's gonna add some extra protein to this smoothie and you're gonna love it. And we need calcium in our diet, guys. This is gonna be a really good post-workout smoothie. So if you guys want, make sure that you work out first before this so that you can load up some more ingredients like this yogurt. All right, cool. Yogurt is in, boom. Next, I got my protein powder. It's gonna be vanilla protein powder. You guys can use whatever vanilla protein powder you want. But if you wanna use the stuff that I use, it's by Juice Plus and it's Complete Mix. It's in the link in the description below. So go ahead, check that out if you want. So all right, so I'm gonna to toast, toast? I'm gonna to toast this in to the blender. <laughs> Perfect, all right. Now that's done. The last thing that we're gonna do is we're gonna take this cup of fruit. This cup of fruit, okay? So remember, it's gonna be watermelon, coconut, strawberry, banana, and pineapple. This is gonna be a very nice, tasty smoothie. All right, I just can't wait for this, okay. Let's go ahead and sprinkle that bad boy in there. Bam, bam, cool. Now it's time to blend this baby up. Here we go, toss the lid on, hit the on button, chop. There we go. Look at that sucker blend. All right, now that's done blending. It took a little while. I'm gonna assume it's because of the coconut. Coconut's a very hard um, fruit. So it'll take a little bit of some time, all right? All right, so I'm gonna take the same cup that I just used to toss the fruit in, just so that, you know, we consolidate cups. Bam. Now here we go. Woo! That looks good. All right. It's falling off the blender. Ah, gotta save it. Now, the ultimate test. We must see if this tastes delicious, and I guarantee it will. <laughs> Let's give it a shot. That is really good. Coconut, you really taste the coconut. If you guys like coconut, that's really good. Woo! So it was watermelon, pineapple, banana, strawberry, and coconut. That's a perfect blend. Make sure that when you add the yogurt, make sure it's plain. Don't add the vanilla because the vanilla is already going to come from the protein powder if you do add protein powder. But if you don't add protein powder, add vanilla Greek yogurt if you want to get some of that vanilla flavor into the smoothie itself. And that will also help thicken it up a little bit as well. Guys, this was really good. Um, if you have any questions or comments, do that below and then I'll get right back to you very fast. Thank you guys for watching. This was another smoothie time with your boy Dakota. This was delicious, and I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Bam!